It's in my. I'm over at Mali Butchers, a world famous Mali Butchers, and behind me, I've got Anand, and I've got his whole team. Right, I got myself some Wagyu meat. Now, if you don't know what that is, right, it's some Japanese famous beef. Right, I'm gonna check this out. I'm gonna go home and try it. It's gonna be in the later part of this video. In the meantime, check out the promo for Mali Butchers. Halal street food. Wagyu meat. You saw me earlier, right, buying Wagyu, which is a Japanese beef. This is like some of the most expensive beef you can actually buy. It's a lot of money, right? But is it worth it? I want to do something with a little bit of a twist. Everybody has Wagyu, as in like small bite-sized pieces or a steak. Ah, uh -uh. check this out. Wagyu, this is the, right? Look what I done with it. I made it into a little kebab which you can put into i don't know like a as a cheeseburger or what have you not cooking wise you're talking about literally a couple of minutes here and there you do not want to overcook it you'll overkill it right moment of truth it's time for some wagyu with our vegetable rice and our seasoned salad not forgetting our seasoned salad right All right going in Melted away. That's so soft. That is proper soft. That's probably the first or second time I think I've tried Wagyu. I have tried it before, right? But turning into like a patty, like a cheeseburger patty, I did like that. The steak's up next, okay? So let me show you again. Have a look at this. So just a couple of seconds, right? Sorry, a couple of minutes on one side, a couple of minutes on the other side. Look how tender that has become. Look at that. It's proper melt in the mouth stuff. Literally, if you can't have teeth, this will be fine. It is good. It's really, really good. Is it worth the extra money? Um, I'll let you know once I've had the steak. Let's get on to the steak. Guys, I'm out trying to discover new food places. Do not forget to hit the like, subscribe, and the bell icon. Here comes the rest of your video.
Wagyu steak time. Check this out. Literally, right? I would say two to three minutes on either side. That's all I've cooked it for. I don't like my steak to be raw, but at the same time, it must be cooked. So, it is. Always compliments with the the fries. Right. What's better? Honestly, it's melting in the mouth. Look at that. It is literally melting in the mouth. I don't know if I should bite it, if I should just put it in my mouth and let it just, just, just drop in. What the? It's this is, this is proper. I need some fries to go with this, right? Wagyu. So, what was the better decision? Having wagyu as a steak or doing it as a mince? like patties and then like a burger the steak if you're going to do wagyu right you must do it in the steak form it just tastes a lot better definitely a lot better that's been the wagyu uh over from malik butchers in wolverhampton excellent uh value for money there isn't any it's very very expensive you're probably talking about 150 pound a kilo right to get this stuff um you definitely do try it once once in a blue moon, I don't think it will hurt you, right? But it's brilliant. You've got to check out these guys. Their meat is fantastic. The, the, the actual marination of the meat they do is brilliant as well. I'm really impressed by Malik. Adnan, thanks ever so much. Guys, you're watching The Bearded Bros. Carry on watching The Bearded Reviews. If you had to try last time, mind blowing stuff is I walked into the I'm a stall and they didn't even give me a chip. Oh, they serious chip.